that, man? Your house is empty. Oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Coming, Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> Listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And, I, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Meriwether. Mm, those assholes. Big yeah. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition mm. it. Fantastic. Let's go. Come in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, OK? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip, but... Great! Right, let's go! What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. we got to meet them in the air. I... Uh, okay, well, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit! Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Meriwether networks? Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I gotta. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultancy and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. Crop duster? That's the best we can do? Call our guys south of the border. Tell them there's a fire sale. I'll get you on the radio. I got the cargo plane right ahead of me. He's got the weapons we're using to enslave us on board. If we could get a hold of them, oh my god. Are you planning on... 
on forcing them to land? Didn't I say we had to take them in the air if we're to have any kind of shot at this? I thought I said that. You did. It's just I don't see how you're going to... Ah, you'll see. Cargo planes on my 12. You're gonna use those weapons for no good, T. They'll be better in our hands. I know it isn't my place to ask, but how exactly do you plan on requisitioning this equipment and you've caught up to them? Whoa! One step at a time, Ronald. Let's just get there first. You want me to put my nose into the dirt? Dick? They'll start monitoring you at that altitude. You got bad information, brother. I'm fine. We're flying by the military base now. Avoid it, boss. Don't fly over. Yes, squadron leader. You know, Ronald. Ronald, you there? We need each other. Flying the high's gonna draw attention. I'm plenty low enough, Ron. So 
Come. I'm in control of this. You speak to Oscar? The Mexicans? This deal on? I'll let them know it's in the works. The works? I'm not risking life and limb for a shimmonate soul. Are you sure? It's just Oscar don't like getting messed with. You got a job, man. They're on their screens. You want me to put my nose into the dirt? Dick. chances, pal. Now, who's gonna fly 
by this thing. Meriwether Cargo Jet to Ground Control, please be advised of a change of destination. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field. Swapping radio channels. Over. Ron! Ron, you there? I got the jet. You with the buyers? Welcoming party's here, Trevor. Fly safe now. Who are these guys? Attention, Mary Weather Jet. We're under orders to escort you to base. Change course or we will engage. Oh, are you? Good diddle yourself. Hey, Ron. So, um... Frickin' air forcer on me! It's a big plane, boss! You might want to gain some altitude! Shit! Gain some altitude! They might not tangle with you up there! We'll see if that helps! Comply immediately! Maybe I'll give you 10% of what's in the hole, then we're all happy! Understand the effort I've gone to be here, pal. This is your final warning. Divert now or be engaged. Hey, you wouldn't shoot me down anyway. Think of the ground casualties. Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down! I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank God! The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. Ah, oh, good idea! But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage. 
The cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. <laughs> 